you wrote an article in September of last year against bailouts. Then in October, you voted for the first TARP bailout. What was the constitutional reason, reasoning behind that, and would you have done it again, knowing how it's been used? No. No is the answer uh, to how it was being <coughs> used. But let me tell you the, the history of what happened in September. In September, the Secretary of the Treasury for President Bush came in and said, we're looking at a global meltdown. And if we don't shore up the institutions that are too big to fail, uh, then it will not only be a catastrophe in America, but all of the investors in America from foreign countries would pull out, which would collapse our economy. So we did almost, I mean, virtually, I don't remember the vote. You might know how many voted, but it was the overwhelming vote of Republicans as well as Democrats to do the first bailout. We put restrictions on it so that it was $350 uh, billion first, and then you had to come back and do the second one, which from that point, from the 350 on, I voted no. I voted against the stimulus. I voted against the second tranche of TARP because they didn't use it just for financial institutions. Even President Bush came in and used it for um, GM, the auto uh, bailout, and so it, would, it has been used for so much government intervention, especially in the Obama administration, that uh, I haven't supported anything beyond that first $350 billion, but no stimulus and not the second. What about the free market and all of this, though? I mean, the, the initial bailout still undermined the free market. What are your thoughts for the free market? What's your support for the free market? And yes. how would that translate to state policy? The, in the first part, <laughs> it did go to financial institutions as loans, and just almost all of those have been paid back. Except for AIG, the rest have been paid back because those, those banks didn't want it. Uh, mostly. Some of them were forced to take it, which I also thought was wrong. Uh, but a lot of that has been, been paid back, and it should be paid back. The rest of this government takeover of so many uh, other functions of our government is absolutely wrong. And of course, we're voting against this, and we're talking against this every day. 